Are you a motherfucking rookie? Yo, Trump! I haven't seen your ugly ass in a hot minute. What up, Trump? I can't tell you. I gotta ask you questions first. What's up? I could do it. Don't you call him Pandora. On any vlog. All right, you're going to the show, guys. As always, I'm your host, Soul Palazzo. And today we got my main man here. Sketch. Chris. Steve. Gorilla Gorilla. Richie. Your boy Paul. Rukula. George. You don't grab the mic, I grab the mic. Sean Weber. Steve, tell us where you're from. Soundview, Bronx. Freeport, New York, out on Long Island. Bronx. That sounds gangster, Steve. Not really. I know, I know, I was, I was, I was joking. Orlando, Florida. Hey, I'm Mexican. Mexican. Where you from? In New York, Polly. I'm everywhere, baby, ask about me. You've raced for one long song. We're a London based team. How do you like your first time in New York, man? I love it. So, over look, today we are playing Are You a Rookie? And we're going to find out if you are indeed a rookie. So, it doesn't matter where you're from or where you are, if you write fixed gear, you'll probably get them right. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm always ready. I am not a rookie. All right, let's, we're about to find uh, out. Cycling forks come in two common sizes. What are they? One inch or one and one eighth inch? One and one eighth and one inch. Not or, baby. And. One inch? Um, I think you mean... Inch and one eighth and an inch? Just one inch and eighth and one and eighth? No, no, I think you mean... I'm asking questions, you're giving me the answer. No, no idea. Okay, give me so two, Steve. Two standard ones is an inch and a one and one eighth. One and one eighth. And what's the other? Uh, one inch. I'll pass. Nah, nah, that's not what we do here, baby. One eighth and one inch? A one inch is correct. Do you want to try that? Second Three one eights. again. No, no, no. Say it again. Three eighths. No, say it again, but better. Three eighths. <laughs> one inch and one inch. Come in. I know, I know when you get like uh, uh, soup cream, uh -huh. it's like a 1.8. Uh, uh, no. uh, they gonna cut your ass, boy. Yeah, they're gonna finish me, bro. <laughs> Are you proud of yourself, Steve? Not really. Why not? Because I know I can do better. <laughs> it's the first question. <laughs> Always strive to push yourself, all right, kids? Stay in school. Maybe I'm overthinking this too much. I'm just like, wait, is this a trick question? Easy at the beginning. Okay. Don't, say, don't think right, too hard. Right. What year did Red Hill Crit start and where? It started in Brooklyn. Oh, we got you right now. <laughs> It started in 2007. Oh, wait, 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 Okay, that is a correct. Started in Brooklyn. That is correct. Even though that's not the order I ask questions, but whatever. So 2018, take away what is this, number 11? What's that? The uh -huh. 1900. You'd be surprised how many people did that math and got it wrong. 2007, 2008? Uh, 2011. Brooklyn. You can't say two numbers, Steve. You gotta be one or the other. Oh, wait. It's actually. years ago. 2008. Oh. It'll be silly if it's not anywhere else. Do you have any uh, bike message experience? Yeah, I'm a bike messenger. Right, copy. You come out from finishing a drop and you realize that your rear tire has been slashed. What do you do? Cry a little bit. You are a bike messenger, right? Yes. yes. All right. <laughs> I'm a dollar bill. I'm a tire. That's life. Somebody was hanging. You got like three jobs on you, bro. Right. You must have had said your mother ugly slashed you while you was in on a 15th floor. Immediately look around to see if there's any suspicious characters around me. That's a fact. My son, uh, I just fix it and keep doing my job. And how would you fix the flat after your tire has been slashed? You hope that you have a dollar bill in your pocket. A metro card folded in my tire. Change the tube. Mm. You get the dollar bill, you put it. The tube in the tire. Right. You pump it up and you're good to go. Right. And it got to be American. It could be foreign. Roll a joint, open a can of beer and call it quits for the day. Well, if it's okay with this match, it's okay with me. Yeah, I'm a professional contact dispatcher, so I'm complaining about it on social media. <laughs> Yo, bro, I'm asking, what would you do? I go to a bike shop because I don't fix my own shit. Honestly. George, if it's your mate, then just have a laugh. But like, if it's your enemy, your your mate would never stop you from making a dollar. You chase him down the road with the other wheel, and then uh, just take him out. <laughs> like a frisbee. 
we only have five pound notes. Okay. That's the smallest, so we use five pound notes. Oh, we use any note. Okay. Oh yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah. You can put a fifty pound note in there if you want, but yeah, yeah, you know, say till payday. If you're a baller, yeah, like. a good courier is a blank courier. Fill in the blank. Yeah. 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 That is correct. Rapid courier. Sexy courier. Uh, we're looking for more than efficiency size, Steve. Good courier is a polite courier. Who said sexy isn't efficient? <laughs> Never go wrong being polite. <laughs> Timely. All right. All right, judges. All right, Steve Israel, quick, we'll take that because y'all looking so good in these kits. Smart courier. Courier is the best courier. GXP and Squid Taper. What is the difference between these two bottom brackets? Oh, okay, well, I've heard of this one. Squid Taper is not very uh, uh, 30 seconds on the clock, Chris. Oh, damn, well, I, I didn't know this clock. The square taper is for um, the old roadies. <laughs> and the GXP square taper is square. It's for. Uh, you know this is a square taper on my bike right now. Square taper is. You need different tools to take them apart. I don't know what the difference is. And the GXP is like a very race and sits on the outside of the frame. GXP is external bearing. Oh, Best chain rings. Dude, the world. Yo, I, I follow you guys on Instagram. You, you guys follow him on Instagram. Stuff. Can I get one? A oh, pleasure, one? man. You already know. Always a love. Always love. Do you disagree with this answer or you have anything different to say? I completely agree with what everything that George had just said. Off of uh, you know, plain reasoning, and the GXP is diamond shape and the uh, square is square. Square tape. <laughs> you know, I'm not dumb, but I'm not smart neither. GXP has external bearings. I use GXP, so my main difference is you can take it off with a helicopter. Square taper clearly. Well, that's the Sujano 75, it's her square taper, and the GXP goes for Omniums. Square oh, taper ones, you need uh, that tool that nobody likes to use. Nobody knows how to use that. Square taper is just. Um, it's an axle with bearings that are fitted on the axle on the inside. Get alert, Chris. Don't get mad. I don't need to know what cracks. One's a square, like it says, and one's a circle. <laughs> different square tape, you could work with it, and it, your left side can break it, and you still work the whole thing. Key difference. I'm a rookie, bro. I, 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 I see that. I can't, I can't tell you. You know, I can tell you how it works. Yo, what's up? Yo, shout out to my man Soho right here. Man, you ready? ready? The BK love. Oh, you're my sis right here. You're I ready, love her. Best, 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 best. Yo, you ready, bro. You're ready. You're ready. I feel like if I watched more on the block with Soho, I would understand that. You just might. Are you ready for the next question? Yes! The relationship between a dispatcher and a courier should be like that of A. Your parents. B. A lion and a gazelle. C. Sasuke and Naruto. Or D. A bacon, egg, and cheese. Oh, bacon, egg, and cheese. I like anime, so Sasuke and Naruto. Bacon, egg, and cheese. 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 I reckon you just go like mum and dad, you know? I think that dispatchers should be buying our lunch, buying our dinner. I have to say bacon, egg and cheese. Buys beers. I think they should, I think dispatchers should do a lot of things for us. Bacon, egg and cheese. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Oh. The bacon, egg and cheese. I train more for this than the race. Hey, <laughs> mum and dad, your final answer, man. 150%. <laughs> because they tell you what to do and where to go and when to take a B. You have one job. What is cadence? Occasional pattern that you maintain rotationally. I know, I know what it is, uh -huh. but don't know what it is. explain it. Um, Frank's Revelations Feminine. Matt? It's a, a band that not many people know about from 1962. Um, they kind of played a jazz funk sort of fusion. Um, a little Amy Winehouse kind of thing. No, no, more sort of probably oh, Adele. Rest in peace, by the way. It's sort of Adele's voice, but with Amy Winehouse emotion. Oh, that's deep. But I'm sorry, that's incorrect. The amount of spin you put in. How fast you could run to the toilet. Cadence is perfect. Oh, you're just doing this. It, uh, isn't that, isn't that the, the speed of your, your leg rotation or something like that? No, no. Cadence is how fast you spin your... Pedals? Yeah. Cadence. Well, yes. Right. Cadence is ability to keep a spin consistent. Cadence. 
cadence. I don't know. I know what it is. I know what it is. I'm gonna say RPM. Of what? Your revolutions per minute. Of what? And Jordan, you are out of time. Basically, the speed you're maintaining your pace at when you're pedaling. That's cadence. You wanted cadence, I give you f cadence. Boss, hey, Jack Chris. Speed is your speed, your cadence, your the rhythm, speed the of the rhythm, pedal, speed of pedal strokes. I will take that of oh, revolution. Revolution. Oh, yeah. Boy, it ain't only for black people, baby. Okay. <laughs> So Jason, tell us how how was it out there? Oh, it was great, man. It was fun. It was fast. These guys are super pro, dog. How did you feel about your performance out there today at Red Hooker? Uh, I felt really great. Uh, I was in another chance race. I was sitting second wheel. Okay. My back tire blew out and I crashed out. But um, two to go. So strong. You'll be moving on to the no, next race? No, I will not. No, but are you proud of how far you come out at this event today? Hell yeah, bro. I was there. I'm there. I'm there with these but, guys, but I didn't. But we here. All right, here. but you're definitely going to be coming back next year, right? Oh, dog. You already know every That's year until I get in there. Already know, right? um, what components make up the drivetrain to fix your bike? I want specifics. Metal. So you apply force, and the bike goes forward. All right, name all that. You got a crank set, a bottom bracket. The crank set is composed of? Yeah. Uh, Pedals. Yeah, like, you know, like, I put my foot. Chain. Cups. One that I've been running for the past three or four months to be, um, you know, they're composed of the same components. 48, 14, with oh, no, 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 no. Five chain ring bolts. You need right. uh, some ceramic bearings. Ooh. You need ratio. Mm -hmm. Crank on. Crank on. Pedal. Pedal. Time attacks. Uh huh. Your rear clock. Clock ring. Sure. Is that your final answer? Yeah, it should be. I'm bleeding the fifth. I can't find it. That? Nah. But you that forgot. Lock ring. Part of the car. What about you riding a freewheel? Oh, but it's this biscuit, baby. Oh, cool, cool. All right, he's gonna yell right next to us while we're doing the show. All right, that's cool. Go for specifics here. You know what I'm saying? That's how we do on the block. Uh, a non-drive side crank is on the left, uh -huh. and then you got the drive side with the spider on the right, and then you put your FSA. Uh -huh. 49 or 48 or 53, whatever you ride, Ooh. and then you get your Izumi Gold, Ooh. and then you get your 14 duration in the back or, or originate. All right, but is that it? Is that all the parts? That's part of the drivetrain, that's it. That's every it. single part, though. That's is that every it. single part? In drivetrain, yeah. Oh. Or in the lock ring. Oh, that was like my bad. What is the Bye. recommended gear ratio for crit racing for men and women at Red Hook Crit? There's no right or wrong. I just look at the Red Hook website, they have a oh. recommended <laughs> ratio for. <laughs> This race, yes. Uh, is the same one for both? Try, try, question. 15. 15. Alright, since I like you, Chris, I know you for a long time. I'm gonna oh, give you high? a second chance. 49, 15? It's actually correct, but yes. is it for men or women? Oh. I to say men. <laughs> <laughs> can't get a perfect score. I'm out. Get out of here. OG, but he young, you heard? Oh, I ain't young. Goodbye. He is not okay, he is not okay. Uh, that pizza tripped me up, you know, but I'm still out here for the Red Hook Crit all day. Are you part of yourself? No. I am not either. Yo, this guy doesn't know. Okay, I am indeed you, a rookie. I'll be back, I'll be back on the show. <laughs> Never, yo, man, no <laughs> Am I a rookie? <laughs> yes. You are. Oh, <laughs> you know, medium vet, you know, like almost a vet. You a vet or you not? <laughs> I'm a medium vet. <laughs> <laughs> you like Tarzan. <laughs> <laughs> I want my money back. <laughs> the show free, baby.